Well, if you could alleviate any fear or stress of flying, would you maybe do it? And what about for your kids? New this morning, there's an opportunity to do exactly that coming up this weekend at Minot International Airport. Yeah, Becky Farr is live there now with all the details on what this program is all about. Becky? Good morning, Tim and Alicia. Thanks to national and local organizations coming together, the Wings for All program will take place here this Saturday. It focuses on helping people who face unique challenges in trying to navigate trips around the airport. There are many moving parts in order to get on board a plane and fly to a destination. Lots of plans to make and steps to take. For many, and especially those with intellectual or developmental disabilities, it can be a scary, intimidating experience. That's where Wings for All comes in. Just to get everybody familiar with what can you expect, what do you need to do from step A to step Z, so to speak. The free program allows participants to go through the motions of traveling. We want travel to be something everybody can do. Checking in, riding an escalator, going through TSA security, and waiting at the gate pretty much every step of the way. This um, can oftentimes be the first kind of eye opener. Is this something that our family can handle? Is this something that our child can handle? Donna Bai initiated bringing Wings for All to Minot. Her 12 year old daughter has autism. We have not been able to take a family vacation for um, anxiety fears that we have as parents. Um, how will she react? How will people around us react? How will the airlines react? Wings for All is designed for people like Donna and her family to get a safe and realistic travel experience. It also aims to open doors for future travel opportunities. Our daughter does not like to wait. Um, she's also very sensitive to overhead speakers, so we look at that as when they're announcing all the safety instructions overhead, um, and those noises tend to bother her. Participants will really get to experience all aspects of traveling by air, including walking down the jet bridge and actually boarding the plane. So when the real thing happens, travelers feel more familiar than fearful. Again, the program is free, but for security and organization purposes, registration will close at the end of the day tomorrow. So for a link to register or just for more information about Wings for All, visit our website, kxnet.com. Tim and Alicia, back to you. I bet there are a lot of families out there hearing about this and thinking that's a great idea for us. I'm thinking just wow right now, just the overhead speaker. My son, we were just talking about it, is very sensitive to those overhead yep. speakers. So yeah. what a great program for families. Thanks for sharing that, Becky.